Just like any other church in America, we have services where uh, people come here to congregate and be spiritual. However, what makes us different is that we're the only church in the world that allows its congregation to smoke weed in our church. And as we were living in the church and updating the church, that's when we got the idea, wouldn't it be really cool to keep this a church, but take away all the bad parts of church that we didn't like uh, growing up, the organized religion, the pushing dogma, and instead be very open-minded and allow people to uh, have their own spiritual journeys. <laughs> This church is not about Christianity. We have Christian members, we have Jewish members, we have Buddhist members, and we have atheists that come to this church. It's really about being the best version of you. So we call it elevationism, and elevationism is about elevating yourself to the best version of self possible. Our church has approximately 15,000 members right now, and uh, our members uh, are all over the world. So, you know, we're not just a local, that's why we're called the International Church of Cannabis, because we have members from over 100 countries. Yes, we bring in revenue by charging tickets to come and see the church and see our uh, light, laser light show and our guided meditation. So that's how the church sustains itself.